Welcome everybody, it's Solomon in this video we are going to be talking about the trophies for Shell and Shuffle Just going to be going through all of them, we're going to see what we have for our next zombies map This is going to be pretty sick, some of these trophies are pretty darn sick, I cannot wait to talk about them But they are so cool, so mainly just going to be reading through all of them, say what I can about them And then move on to the next one So there are three hidden trophies which I'll save for the end because I just like doing that But first we'll go through all the revealed ones, of course we can see the hidden ones I really don't know why I hide them if you could just go and reveal them But anyways, back to what we're talking about, so the first one we're going to go to is bookworm in shell and shuffle find and collect all the bios for aj andre point dexter and sally so this is so cool if you guys watched my video i talked about what i wanted in this next zombies map it was for a background to their characters the to the real characters or who they were before they actually got caught up in this whole willer wyler mess and now that i see we're getting bios for them this just gets me so hyped for the map and i just cannot wait to see what this is all about i'm just so hyped you guys wouldn't believe this is just so cool i love what i'm seeing next one we have is coin op in shell and Shuffle complete skull buster. I have no idea what skull buster is, sounds cool, but nothing I can really say about it. Next one is slice and dice. In shell and shuffle and pack a punch, the final weapon. Now, the final weapon, what that can mean, I have no idea. Maybe it's a special weapon like the chainsaw that we had for Raven the Redwoods, but we'll have to see when we actually get the map. Next one is pest control. In shell and shuffle, recover one piece of the soul key. So, we're back to that soul key stuff. Of course, the main Easter egg right here. Can't wait to figure that thing out, but of course, can't really say more than that. Next one is shell and skill. In Shell and Shuffle, max all Chi abilities in a single game. So this one sounds really cool. Of course, now we have a name to those abilities that we saw inside the trailer. They are called Chi abilities, so that's cool. But I just can't wait to see. I didn't even know they were going to be maxable, but that's just so cool. I can't wait to see what this map has to offer with all this new cool stuff. The next one we have is Soul Brother. In Shell and Shuffle, collect all the newspaper clippings. This is probably going to be like the sticker pack thing and all that other stuff that we had from the previous map. So it's going to be some collectible things. I can't wait to see what this is about because in Raven the Red woods when you would collect these you get some storyline to people who died inside the map so maybe we have something similar to that i don't want to repeat even though it's cool i wouldn't mind a repeat of the same thing but it'd be cool to see if we get something new and some more information from other things maybe some information about the people inside the movie so the actual movie and the last one that we have for the revealed ones is some assembly required in shell and shuffle build all the craftable items in a game so this is really cool so now we're getting craftable items back these craftable items were got really popular inside treyarch zombies and now that they're bringing them into Infinity Ward Zombies, I can't wait to see them. I love this stuff. Of course, this is probably going to be a shield. At least one of them is going to be shield. This shield is one of the best craftable items in the game. So I can't wait to get my hands on that. Hopefully, unless there's not a shield, that'd be kind of disappointing. But either way, it's going to be sick to see craftables returning. I can't wait to see what they're doing. Can't wait to see. Maybe they're going to have some new ones I've never seen before. But we'll have to see when we actually get the map. So now for the three hidden trophies. So the first one is Beat of the Drum. In Shell and Shuffle, find the hidden song. So we've had one like that all the time inside all the three maps so far so that's cool but the next we have exterminator is shell and shuffle defeat the final boss with a special guest so this is probably going to be beating the easter egg twice except the second time when you have unlocked pam greer as a playable character you just beat it again and what i'm pretty hyped for is maybe just maybe when we actually beat it for the second time with a special guest we'll get this trophy and we will actually get some more storyline or something special when we beat it the second time with the special guest i hope that's the case but we'll have to see when we actually get the map and now this one this one is so vague and I really don't know what it means, but it says message received. The end of the longest journey is a single step. Like, oh my gosh, that, that just gets me so hyped for the map. I just honestly cannot wait now. This thing is so cool. That name, message received, and the end of the longest journey is a single step. Holy crap, this is so cool. This, this one just got me so hyped for the map. I honestly cannot wait for this map. We're waiting one more week, but we'll have to see everything that happens inside this map. Tell me what you guys think about all these trophies down in the comments. Do you guys like them? What do you guys think about them? Anything like that. They are just so cool. I think this is so cool. I honestly am insanely hyped for this. I really haven't been high, this hype from map since all the way back in Treyarch Zombies, even though I was pretty hyped for Raven the Redwoods, but it just hasn't been on this level in a while, so this just gets me pretty hyped, so tell me what you guys think about this, go ahead and leave your opinions and anything down in the comments, but that's about it for this video, if you guys did enjoy the video, go ahead and thumbs up, if you guys want to stay tuned for content similar to this, go ahead and subscribe, but I'm gonna go and I will catch you guys on my next video.